What's up guys, ComputerMD of Gilbert here, and in today's video, I'm going to show you an updated version of how, how to add a site search to your Wix website. Before we begin, guys, WixMyWebsite.com, this is my new upcoming course I'm building for you. I'm showing you how to take a Wix website from scratch and build it to completion to whatever you want. You'll be completely in control of your website. And not only do I want you to learn how to build your own website, I want you to learn a greater and more vast knowledge of Wix. And that's my main goal for you guys. I'm here to teach you. I'm here to help you. So if you get the chance, go to WixMyWebsite.com. Click this notify me when it's live button. Get on the email list to get notified when this course goes live. I'm telling you guys, you're going to want to be on this email list and you're going to want to be on it soon because we have a lot of big stuff on there and the email list will be the first to know when the course goes live and the first 10 people to enroll will get an extremely valuable gift that you will not want to miss. Anyway, guys, let me show you how to add a site search here in Wix. We're going to go to app market. And we're going to type in site and you'll see site search by instant search. You'll then click add to site, add app. And then you'll see this search design button here, the search bar. You'll drag it to wherever you need to on your website. Once you do that, we're going to double click for settings. Once you double click it, you're first going to see site search is a fast and friendly service for visitors to find content on your site. So you need to upgrade to sync with your website you could access search statistics with that it opens in the site search Wix my website account um, and then down here you can see you use 0 of 30 monthly searches so to get more than 30 searches a month on your website using this app you would have to upgrade and the premium plan is either pay $4.99 a month annually or pay $5.99 a month every month and just, you know, cancel whenever you want. The annually is the longer plan, but that's what they want to try to get you on. Um, but you do this to whatever you need. If you feel like 30 searches is going to be fine for every month, then just stay with the free plan. But if not, definitely go on to premium uh, as you'll need it if you're expecting a lot of site searches. After you do that, you can see settings right here. So the settings of this, site language. So I would set this to auto detect. You could have it in English, but if you have, or whatever language you are, but if you have it set to auto detect, it'll automatically detect whatever language the user is in and populate results based off of that. Um, and then right here, you see results in a new tab. If you want the results to open in a different tab, not on your website you can click that but if you want to keep them on your website make sure that stays off you can see right here search field so this is the text that is inside the search bar right here um, and search bar didn't want to stay up for us right there anyway search uh, placeholder text so this is the search site uh, where it says they're in the site search and you could change this text to say whatever you like, maybe search website, maybe get answers, something, whatever you would like. Uh, but you could change that text and customize it to your needs. Uh, and right here it says show inline prediction. So this pretty much just means that it, it the site search is inline um, and you can show as well drop down suggestions. So if you're starting to type in something, uh, a popular search result, it'll drop down suggestions, uh, just kind of like Google would do. It's that same thing if you're starting to type in like top five and then it shows top five blank, top five blank, top five blank. Same thing, same concept. And then down here you see search results. Now this is a upgraded feature. Right now it has site search plus logo, um, but you can get some of these other options that are specifically only for premium users. But right now it's just the site search plus logo. Um, so this, if you're upgrading and you need more than 30 results a month, I would definitely change this. But if, if you're not, I, this isn't something to sweat, I wouldn't say. And then finally, you could say show contact form to users when no results are found. So another premium feature, if the results aren't found on your website or you can't find it through the search, you can have 
a contact form that email or that users will email you their question and it would go to this email whatever that is but again you need the premium plan to do so websites decided to glitch out a little bit there site search there anyway so that's the settings and then the design is completely up to you you can change the colors of the search button uh, the corners the shadows the titles the font whatever you need and then you also see support here that's developer info um, you can sign up for their newsletter not as important but anyway guys this is a very good tool to have especially if you have a site that will have a lot of questions and again you're gonna want to sync now um, you have to upgrade and syncing now helps sync the search results to your website anyway guys that's how you add a site search here on Wix a little bit more updated uh, I hope this video helped you guys out if it did please drop a like down below comment if you have any questions at all maybe not even this particular topic but feel free if you do um, but any Wix questions at all please go ahead and let me know and don't forget to subscribe to me here on Computer MD of Gilbert as I'm looking forward to growing here as a channel, as a community, uh, and it subscriptions obviously help the channel grow. Along with that growth, WixMyWebsite.com, this new course, I'm here to help you guys grow, not only show you how to build a Wix website, but show you how to gain knowledge on Wix so that you have that knowledge to come back to your website even after you've built it and been, be able to say, yeah, I want to add this or do that and know how to do it. Um, but I'm here to help you guys grow. I look forward to launching this course with you guys right by my side. And I look forward to um, just seeing the results happen. So anyway, guys, makes me really happy. Go to WixMyWebsite.com, sign up right here, notify me when it's live, and get on that email list. Other than that, guys, thanks for spending a couple minutes with me. I'll catch you on the next one.